to the esotericist, an artist is someone who responds to the vibration of some aspect of reality to which he attunes himself and then gives that expression. And without expression, there would be no art. Art, of course, all painting is a convention. There is no way the painter can deal with flesh and blood, sinew and bones. He's dealing with forms and colors, usually on a flat surface, and creating an artificial thing, an illusion, either a sign or a symbol. Every art is the result of a sign. When a child makes a, an oval shape and puts two eyes and a, and a stroke for a nose and a, another stroke for a mouth, it has created a, a sign which stands for head. And we all recognize it. There are archetypal universal symbols which as soon as we see them we recognize as man, head, dog, horse, or whatever. However, unlike in naturalistic terms, the sign may be to the original form. We take this for granted. We read into these signs that which we know they stand for. Even the most naturalistic image, photographic type image, when it is placed on a flat surface in form and color, is itself a convention and a sign of some kind. It stands for a head, a woman, a dog, a, a plate of apples, or whatever. Signs can go further than being simply signs standing for. They can be signs which become, if conveying meaning, symbols. And as a painter, I feel my own painting has moved from the sign to the symbol. These symbols, of course, can be at different levels. The greater the art, the more profound the symbol will be. The more expressive it will be of the meaning which it symbolizes. The great art of the past, of the Leonardo's and the Raphael's of the Rembrandt's, the Michelangelo's, and so on, have their resonance in our lives today because of the, the nature of the artist who created them. Because from his profound response to the world of meaning, drew from these symbols which, from their knowledge of their craft, they were then able to describe, express in pictorial terms. The symbol then is something which conveys meaning over and above that of the sign. While remaining a sign, it is a way into that aspect of reality which we call beauty or God. And the great artist is someone who can show us something of the nature of that mysterious essence of reality known as beauty and something of the nature of that which we call God.